That is a little bit scary. I've almost got adrenaline. And whoa, 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 whoa! That thing is fast. How's it going through this? It is Happy Days, and welcome back to our Calamity Death Mode, Super Modded, all that good stuff. Let's play. And as you can see, guys, whoa! No, don't kill me, Worm. We are straight into the action today. And guys, our episode today, I am so hyped for. We are preparing to fight the Devourer of the Gods. That's right, people. And it looks like I need to shoot this worm in the in the bottom uh, to, to do damage to it. The rest of it seems to be invincible, and oh, I'm almost dead already. Oh, my goodness. But yeah, guys, we are preparing for the Devourer of Gods, which means we need to fight all of the Sentinels. Oh, that thing is tiny. It went from, like, a big worm to a little worm. Where is it? Where are you, Wormy? All right, putting my minimap on. Worm, where did you go? Where's the... Oh, there it is! There it is! Woo okay, I'm like almost dead. No lightning! No, Happy! Not in the intro! No! Crazy worm! Okay, we got baby worm back. Baby worm is back! No, baby worm! No! Leave me alone, baby worm! Oh, baby worm, no! Oh, this thing is crazy! No! Leave me alone! Oh, it's so fast! Oh, okay, I think we're gonna outrun it. No! No, I can't! Oh my gosh. Okay, we're dropping down. Okay, this arena is all over the place now. I'm looking for heal. I'm like 19 seconds. And I don't know where the baby worm has gone. Maybe I should swap to homing bullets. Okay, that might help. Yeah, beautiful, beautiful. We got the homing bullets. Where have you gone, you crazy worm? Ah, no! <laughs> oh, this thing is so crazy. Oh. No, it's killing my NPCs now. Leave me alone, you crazy worm. Ah! Okay, we're going some rage mode, and I don't know why I'm leading it back to my base. No, stop killing my stuff. <laughs> yes, we got rage and adrenaline. Die, you crazy worm. Die. Yes, we beat it. Oh, oh drop lots of stuff too. <laughs> oh my goodness, my poor NPCs. My poor NPCs is killing them all. <laughs> anyway, let's uh, let's, let's oh, I've got a tombstone in my base. That's just great. Nice way to start the video, Happy. Get destroyed. The lightning orb arc. Oh my gosh. But uh, anyway, guys, looks like we got some weapons. We got a storm dragon, which is ooh, it fires like lots of bullets. That's kind of cool. And we got the storm. Whoa, check it out! Oh my gosh, it's like Daedalus Stormbo, like times a million. That is crazy. And I got armored shells, which crafts are the Cosmic Worm. Yep, yep, yep. Sea Dragon, a lot of you were telling me to make that. And it looks like I should be able to craft that. Oh, that's kind of cool. And what else? A Shadow Bolt Star. And I need Drayden's Forge, so I can't craft that quite next yet. But uh, as I said, guys, we're getting ready for Devourer of Gods this episode, so let's keep going. Oh, I remember when I first fought the death mode I of Cthulhu. I was so surprised how strong it was. Oh, goodness. Oh, Wolfram Staff. Wolfram Staff, save me. No! But I thought we could craft that uh, new gun very quickly because I've pretty much got everything else. I already made the Megalodon. So uh, let's see. A sea Dragon, 302 damage. That's looking pretty nice indeed and I've set up a little uh, target dummy here so uh ooh, okay that's doing some pretty nice damage very good so we'll have to try that out and it turns into something called the mega fleet but I need I think that's an end game bar so that's gonna be a little while but we've still got more sentinels to fight let's keep going okay guys our next sentinel we actually need to battle in the underworld and I think it's called Cygnus or something like that but we'll find out in three two one boom Oh uh, yeah, it is sickness. Okay, this is kind of cool, and I don't think we've seen this one before. And oh, it's teleporting. Hang on, you crazy boss. So we're using our new, uh, we're using our new beautiful sea dragon. Hopefully that helps out with a nice bit of damage. And whoa, that just got fast all of a sudden. Woo, what are you doing? Okay, I'm gonna throw a heal on. Nice and early here. And oh, it's changing forms. What are you doing? Stay away from me. Using my Discord. You stay right back, you crazy boss. Ooh, I'm gonna use I'm gonna use rage. I'm gonna use rage. I'm just gonna go for it. Let's get some damage in. Yes, beautiful sea dragon damage. Oh, it looks like the sea dragon's even got like a whoa! It just seems to be shifting form all the time. That is a little bit scary. I've almost got adrenaline. And whoa, 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 whoa! That thing is fast! Oh, I got adrenaline up! Yep, yeah, beautiful. More damage, more damage! 
Woo! No, it's teleporting. Woo! Oh my goodness. Okay, there we go. Oh, we're doing pretty good. I don't want to jinx myself. Maybe it's a new sea dragon helping. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, 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 no. You stay right away from me. No! No! Teleporting. Run of Discord. Essential for death mode by the looks of it. Woo! It's down to 70,000. Oh, this one's going pretty good. Okay, beautiful, beautiful. Let's keep doing some damage. No, happy, don't die. You've almost won. Come on. No, 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 no. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. No. Oh, did we kill it? I think I think we killed it. Oh, I almost died. No. You stay right back. Oh, you crazy things. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're good. All the little thingies have gone. Beautiful. So what, what did I get from it? Did I get anything? Hang on. Oh, it drops like a thing. It's probably dropped it in the air. Hang on. What's that? Twisting Nether. <gasps> Check it out. So, yep. So, now I can officially craft the uh, Devourer of Gods item now. There's something called Ather's Whisper. 2,000 damage. <laughs> Holy moly. Oh, I've got the Plasma Rod, and I can probably make that stuff easy enough. And there's something called Venusian Trident, but that needs that Drayden's Forge again. But I can make that uh, Ather's, Ather's Whisper. So... <gasps> I think I need to fight one more sentinel. There was an item I really wanted to get. But uh, apart from that, guys, I think we're almost ready for Providence again as well. Let's zoom ahead. Wow, guys, this new weapon has been helping out quite a bit, and I'm very thankful because we're about to be taking on Providence again. Now, one thing I realized we can craft is something called a Phantom Heart, which gives me 50 more mana. Wow, that's cool. My mana stars have gone pink now. Very cool indeed. Now, the other thing I think I wanted to craft, I can put these things together. I got that from the Ceaseless Void, and that turns into something called an Astral Arcanum. And some of these accessories have been useful for different boss fights, so I'm going to hang on to that. And now the other thing we need to do is actually start to make our Eula Bloom bars. So let's make a stack of those. I've got 140, very nice. I think I can actually craft some more HP. So I'm going to Elderberry. Yes, HP up again, very cool. And uh, the armor sets, I'm going to need more uh, of the Divine Geodes for. But that does remind me, you guys told me to make the permanent... Uh, crafting thing because I'm probably not going to beat Providence first shot although I do have a stronger weapon so now that's not consumed anymore so I can fight it as much as I want I don't need those cores anymore I might as well actually chuck them in the bin actually they don't do anything um, and I think for that now there is some other weapons you can make like this spiker and this plasma rifle and they do look kind of cool but I'm noticing that that these guns like this sea dragon just do so much damage like, I've got my DPS meter equipped Check that out, guys. 17,000 DPS. Like, I don't think I'm going to beat that. It's so useful for Providence. So, anyway, let's go back down to... Oh, no, I'll fight it on the Hello. You guys said I need a new item. Let's go. Okay, waifus. Are you ready for more pain? Because we are back into the underworld. Going to take on Providence. And I know a lot of you said for me to fight it in the Hello. And I will. But I do have this arena set up ready to rock. Which makes a lot of sense. Plus, I'm used to fighting it down here. So, let's get it started in three... Two, one, boom! Okay, let's see if my new weapons help out a bit this time. And yeah, it looks like the Sea Dragon is doing pretty nice indeed. So hopefully that helps out a bit. But uh, you guys have already seen this fight before. So I'll just chat for a little bit, but we will speed up most of it. So one of the major things you need to do against Providence is actually get your adrenaline saved up. Oh my gosh, as I'm about to get hit. Uh, yeah, you really need to get that adrenaline saved up. So you can use it to instantly kill uh, the healing guardian it spawns. So yeah, so it's a uh, little health thing's gone away. So I think I killed it. Where are those other guardians? Yeah, you got to take them out as quick as possible. I probably should do a guide on it actually. I don't know. But uh, anyway, guys, we'll speed this up for you. Let's see how we go.
my gosh, am I gonna do it first shot this time? No way, no happy, you talk too soon! You talk too soon, happy! No, 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 please, no! Please, we're so close, no! Are you kidding? I thought I was gonna do a first shot. Why did you talk, happy? Why did you talk? Ah! Oh, I, uh, I think I actually killed it while I was dying. Oh my goodness, happy, you silly chicken, what's wrong with you? Oh! So did I? I think I did. I think I killed it. Yes, I did it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my gosh, this sea dragon helped so much. Thank you to everyone who was suggesting it in the comments. That has made an insane difference. Oh, I wish I had that the first time I had to fight it. So we got another Elysian Aegis and we got another treasure bag. Uh, some of you guys said there was a good rocket weapon. Anyway, let's see. Three, two, one, boom! <gasps> okay, we got another rune of cost. Yeah, that's it, the blissful bombardier. I think I need rockets for it though, but uh, yeah, that'd be kind of cool. And I got the Providence mask. And we got some more geo d divine geodes. So it's time to craft our tarragon armor. I'm so pumped. <laughs> No, why have we got slimies? What's going on here? But uh, I did want to kind of test out our new bombardier weapon and it looks like it does homing rockets and the explosion radius is absolutely massive. So let's throw on a zerg potion. That should speed this up. I don't know if it speeds up the slimies or it speeds up the normal enemies. Oh no, I think it's just speeding up the normal things. Oh no, there's like there's like cactus and no, there's stuff going everywhere. Happy, why did you drink the zerg potion? You've just made it worse. Oh yeah, no, there's still a few slimies. But uh, also, can you guys do me a quick favor? I'm putting a link on screen now. I'm thinking of bringing back a tips and tricks series I used to do, and I would actually love you guys to be part of the videos um, by like submitting your tips and then the ones that get picked actually get featured in the videos. So after you finish watching this today, go check it out. I've already pinned a comment there for you guys. And uh, yeah, I'll just pick the best tips and tricks. Oh my gosh, it's a dinosaur. And uh, yeah, I'll probably make the video for early next week. So I'm really looking forward to bringing that series back. Like our top fives we've started doing again. I'm having a lot of fun with them and I think you guys are too. But uh, anyway, let's finish off this slime rain and uh, then we can get back to base and we can finally do our tarragon armor. I've got six slimes to go. We're almost there, four slimies. They seem to be spawning more up the top here. So yes, King Slime, where are you? He's gonna instantly die and I'm dying. King Slime, no! Yes! Oh, poor Slimey. I'm turning off this Zerg potion, it's out of control. Woo! I wonder if this weapon's going to be good against Devourer of Gods. I'm not too sure. I mean, it is pretty nice. Um, it depends if I can hit him multiple times with it. If I can, that would be insane. Dinosaur, get out of the base. What are you doing? Ooh, let's swap to our Sea Dragon. Sea Dragon seems to be great for like single target. So, oh my gosh, I have so much junk in my inventory now. Let's get rid of all of that. And, uh, yes, I've got my treasure bag. And, yeah, I didn't have enough to find geodes. I was like, no! So, I've got, like, 16. So, I had to fight uh, Providence again. Oh, my goodness. One. Boom! So, now I should have enough geodes. Oh, my gosh. Oh, Molten Amputator. Whoa! Check that out. What a cool weapon. <gasps> Bunny, no! Oh, it makes the fly fire blob things come out. So, let's put out all our excess Rune of Cos in there. Got another energy staff. So, what we're going to do... Now I've got the Divine Geodes, I should be able to make the chest piece, beautiful, and then the feet, or the leggings, and as you guys can see, I really am favoring ranger builds at the moment, I mean, you guys might have all your own preferences, so I'm going to go with ranged again, but I might save up and get the other suits as well, so it looks like they're a material as well, ooh! Auric Tesla armor? What's this? Oh my gosh. Wow, look at all this stuff. There's so much to do still. But let's get this equipped and let's see what the set bonus is. So the set bonus is enemies are less like increased hearts. Uh, you get more damage, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so do we do more damage now? Whoa, I think it's gone up a little bit. I think it's gone up. That's very nice indeed. So uh, I think we're ready. Forge of Arrow of Gods, but looking at the time there, guys, we might wrap it up there for today, and next episode will be the pain, as I've been starting my um, arena here as well, for Providence and for Devourer of Gods, so I've just been flattening out all the room and all that good stuff, but yeah, guys, leave me your tips and tricks 
for Providence, I mean, Devourer of Gods or Dog in the comments below. And, oh, treasure bag. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, smash the like button if you're enjoying our series. Subscribe if you want to see more from me. And here's the most important part. As always, you'll stay happy and I'll see you soon. This is Happy Days signing out. See ya.